I'm with Captain Antonio Serrano from the great state of Missouri. Uh, welcome to Nebraska. Thank you very much. Tell me a little bit about your team this year. I know you guys are solid. We have a good team. We have a uh, we have a pretty close knit group of guys. Uh, everybody gets along great. Awesome guys. Uh, we're pretty strong on the top part and a little bit weak on the bottom, especially that number nine spot, which belongs to me. So, so what did you first think when uh, when Eric Hortness, the tournament uh, director, got a hold of you about getting involved? Well, I thought it was a, uh, a great honor to even be, uh, be asked to participate as the state of Missouri. And I know we embraced it. It was a lot of work putting the team together, but the guys uh, were pretty excited to play, and we actually have more guys wanting to play than what we, what we end up with. Awesome. Uh, you've seen Wild Horse uh, now for a couple days. What are your thoughts on the golf course? My legs are itching from all the looking for balls in the weeds. Hold on. The Wooga. But now it's a great golf course, great facility, uh, awesome people, and the golf course was pretty challenging today. Pretty awesome. Um, the competition's pretty stiff. There's good players from all eight states. Uh, were you surprised at the quality of the competition? Or? No, I'm not surprised at the quality. It's a great event, and I know that a lot of people are looking forward to it. I was surprised with some of the scores yesterday, 368 by Illinois, which that's pretty impressive. Yeah, same team, and, and also a 70, I think, 400 par by Kansas. So, pretty good players. And uh, I guess lastly, looking forward to next year already and putting a team together. Absolutely. You know, the guys are already trying to figure out how, how they can get on the team next year. So cool. we'll see what we do. Antonio Serrano, the Missouri captain, thanks for, uh, thanks for bringing your team here. Thank you. Thanks for having us. Appreciate it.